Let me grab those keys on the way back. Get down. Don't shoot him. Yeah, yelling, get down. He's not going to see that or hear you. Did you see that? Sure did. Be ready to shoot. Guys. Oh, man. I'm glad you're here. Oh, of course you are. All right, that wasn't so hard. Can we get out of here before any of these things notice us? Not yet. There's a survivor trapped up there. No way. We got to go now. Listen. I was out here looking for gas, and then, up Bam. in the corner room, I heard crying coming from inside. Who is it? It's a girl. We talked, and she got frightened. I was trying to get in and help her, and she started yelling and saying I was bitten. I tried to convince her I wasn't, and that's when all these guys came out. Dang. Of the a couple almost got me, and I ended up hiding in the ice machine. Lucky you. Now let's go. We can't just leave her. Nope. Damn right we can. You guys are suicidal yep. over a girl. I'm saving her, with or without you. Think about if it was you. <laughs> Fine, let's go save Glenn's damsel in distress. Yep. Gotta save somebody. This is weird. Am I supposed to do something or just watch? I don't, don't know how hard it's going to be to get her out of that room. Yeah, it's more to So we have to kill every one of them in here. Quietly. No one attracts these things. Now let's have a look around. Don't use that gun. There's a pillow over there. That's about as far as I got when it came to supply gathering. <laughs> I'd have an idea for it. We can hide by that pickup. Guess we better grab the damn pillow. Good luck smothering me to death. <laughs> What the hell did you have in mind then? Where to next? Oh, oh man. She, she's eating something. So I have to fight it close. Dang. Just making sure there's nowhere else I can click. Made it. What are you going to do with that? I don't really know. Do you have any tricks for getting into cars? Not without tools, or making a bunch of noise, and none with pillows. <laughs> Can't. No. Okay, we're going to go up. No. Over. They both involve going up. What's that dang screwdriver? I better take the spark plug. Spark plug. 
You should hold on to that. Well, now you know it will. Where'd we go all of a sudden? I wonder if there's anything in the pickup. I wanna break that dang window. Looks like we're out of options here. Spark plug? Let me see the spark plug. What the? I definitely heard that one. What? That could scramble a brain pretty good. That's exactly what I was thinking. Time to have some fun. Back to the wall. Done? Well, that didn't work. Oh, man. Holy cow, I didn't know that would happen. I wasn't ready for the fact that you had to click on it. Wow, I died. Oh, man. I wonder where I have to start now. Okay, I have the screwdriver. Okay, now I know what I have to do. There we go. Not dying now. Hey, you're here. Go that way? Nope. Go back. Okay. I'll wait for it to get closer. No, you won't. That doesn't do it any good. Stab him in the head! You gotta be quick. She's got two more to go. Take the axe. You just stab him in the head, dang it. Now we have something good. Dude, where'd your weapon go? Into that ice pick sized hole. <laughs> Jeez. Holy shit. It's cool. Now we've got this. Are you two done? No. Jerk. Two more. That should help. Time to have some fun. No, 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 no. Why don't you guys lag behind just in case this goes to hell? Okay. We'll be right behind you. Okay. I didn't hesitate. Da -na 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 -na. Da -da -da. Come on. Come on. Why can't I swing? Bam. Ah. Ah. Off the head. Rad. Boom. Open the door, break it in. I already know where I'm going with this one. Hello in there. We're here to help. Please just go away. 
Let's go, guys. No. Nope. In a minute. If you open up, we can take you somewhere safer. We've got a group in town. No, no, no. She's in trouble. No. Miss, we're coming in. Bring it down. Tick <laughs> tick. Stop, just stop. I'm coming out. You better come out. It's for your own good. Get you help. It's too late for that. Cut her head off. She's been bitten. What? I told you. I said go away. I'm bit. But you wouldn't just leave. Let's calm down. You could be fine. I won't be fine. My boyfriend was bitten. You get sick and you die and, and you come, come back, back and, and you kill, kill everything. You get fine. You have a boyfriend? Glenn. I don't want that. <laughs> it's not Christian. Please, just leave me. Please go. Come with us. What if you turn and follow us back to our group? I know that was why I was locked away. I can't let this happen to me. I didn't mean to push that one. You have a gun. So? Can I borrow it? What do you mean, borrow? Give it to me. I can just, you know, end this and then, then there's no problem. We can't whoa, bring her back. Whoa. Please, I don't want to be one of them. They're, they're satanic. Yeah, they are. Give it to her. What? You can't be serious. Do it. No. Then shoot her. Huh? I've seen what hell is like, and it's coming back as one of those things. Yep. Shoot Gotta shoot her. her. Help her out here. You're insane. Just take this thing. She turned. Thank you so much. Fake I know bite. how terrible this must be. We can't watch this. Let's go. We can't go yet. What? Why not? Because somebody needs to pick up the gun. Can't leave it. Yeah. You two go on. Okay. Okay. I'm here with you. You're a good man. Well, that was a giant waste of time. Where did that car come from? Bam. Just one bullet. We're gonna regret it. Traveler Hotel. I think it's one long episode. Everyone all right? Break this up. Yeah, we had some close calls, but Glenn is fine and well yeah. We're okay. Yeah, we're few okay. cans of gas for your pickup in the trunk of my car. Good to hear it. Yeah. Things back here. Quiet. Our friend is still in and out over there. He won't survive any more stress. The next order of business is getting those pills out of the pharmacy. Yep. Mm-hmm. Okay, so I need to go back in here, go out the door. I think that's what I have to do. Where's the dang door? Shouldn't it be right here? What in the world? Can I not change the view? No. Well, I didn't mean to do that. Whatever. How the heck are we supposed to get out there then? What the? How you doing, Glenn? You know. You know. Back up. Do you know the combination for the lock on the gate outside? Yup. Why? Oh, you know. Thought I'd go stretch my legs. <laughs> You're probably better off breaking it if you have to. Ah. Try to get some rest. 
Yeah, right. All right. We'll see if Num Nuts or Dum Dum know what the combo is. How's he doing? I'm not sure I got your name. Yeah. It's Lee. Lily. My dad's Larry. Lily Leary? I was just doing what I had to earlier. Yeah. That was hearts acting up again, and I'm powerless to do anything. Yep, shoot him. I had violence before with my dad. It didn't help. Smack her. You're from here? I work at Warner Robins, the Air Force base. Oh. Uh, Pilot? Nah, just mechanical admin stuff. I deal with a bunch of shitheads and bureaucrats all day. Sometimes a plane, if I'm lucky. You? I work up at UTA. I'm gonna get back to him. Sounds good. Looks like we're breaking the lock. Hey, I'll get some rest, hon. How can I with those things out there? Well, you have to figure it out. How are we doing? Good. Want to go have a look around outside? Yeah, I guess we have to. Let's have a look around. Okay. Breaking the lock, huh? Why don't we just go out the back the way we did to get in? I can't reach that brick. Oh. Awesome. Now to distract those things. Carefully. Can't reach that brick. Think you can do it? No, nah, dang it. Oh man, such a waste. Fiddle around with stuff like that. We should get here. skip this stuff. Not much to do with it now. Man, I miss my robots. All right. You're a strange guy, Doug. I know. All right, open the gate. There we go. Whew. That's one way to do it. Vandalism. Nice. I've got an idea. <laughs> Think you can do anything with this? Do. What's that? Turn on all those TVs. It's universal. I could program it to work with those TVs across the street. Oh yeah. Just hope the power's still on. You can just do that. I memorized all the codes when I was in AV. Let's try. Oh man, what a dork. Nice shirt though. Well, fucking. Ooh, that dumb. was really bright. This dark well, room that I'm sitting in. <laughs> Uh, uh. Now's the time. Yes, it is. Be careful. Keep an eye out, will you? Only thing I know how to do is be careful. Just a little figure of him running, and then he starts walking over there. Put your brother out of his misery. Hey, bud. I don't know what happened to mom and dad, but I know if you were there, you would have died for them. Yeah. Damn. I'm gonna assume that's what happened. Bam. Did you find them yet? Give me a second. He knows what you mean. Faux show. Oh man. 
That's one way to end it. You didn't hit him in the head. Why are you chopping at the neck? Damn. There you go. Jeez. Get them keys. Hey, bud. There we go. Holy crap! Run! They weren't even moving until he yelled, Holy crap! Uh, not that they can't get in the gate or anything now. Dumbass. Man, that was close. But we did it. It's all that matters. It's all that matters. I've got the keys. Great. God, you're amazing. Yeah, Let's I know. Get Pretty amazing. Dun, dun, dun. Oh, why don't we just cut it down? Dang, oh dang. Oh no. Shit. We gotta hurry. Oh man. There would be a damn alarm. What in the hell? Is that a screwdriver in our back? What in the world? That must be his mom. In there. Behind me. Glenn, when you hear me honking in the alley, start getting people out of here. You got it. Doug, Carly, and Lee, you guys make sure our defenses stay up till then. All right. Lee, I better take that axe in case I run into any of them on the way to my truck. Here you go. I got door not locked anymore. Shit. You three, get on it. I'll get back as fast as I can. Mm -hmm. Stay away from the windows. We don't make it. You should know that I think you're a great guy. We will make it through this. Doug, if we don't make it through this, you should know. I should know what? Huh? You said I should know. Shit. Are you sure? Shit. Oh, man. Okay, then. Give it time. Can you look for something to stick in between the handles? Something real strong, okay? Okay. Oh, man. Time to time. Did you find anything? Nothing. Oh, wait. The window is screwed. Go. Oh, man. Ooh. Ugh. I found something. Oh, man. That came. Shoot him. Hey. 
You ain't touching Clementine. Jeez, I'm killing that old guy, this bastard. The hell was that dude doing? What was his d issue? What was I supposed to do? I had to pick one of them. Jeez. I'm killing that old dude. It's ever between him and somebody else. Not saving him. Jeez. I think this is going to be episode one, guys. Thanks for sticking it out through this episode. Oh, man, maybe not. Hey, Glenn. Go then. I think I need to go. To Atlanta? Yeah. I got friends there. And I just can't stay here knowing that they could be trapped in that city. Sounds like nobody knows what's happening there. When we left a few days ago, could have gone either way. I gotta take my chances. All right, Glenn. Take that old bastard with you. Find your friends. Find your friends. Be safe. Thanks, Lee. That means a lot. I don't mean to abandon you all, but this seems like an okay setup. Yeah. And I'm sure things will be back to normal around here in no time. No, That's they all. won't. You guys be safe. We'll try. And Lee, you know, if this doesn't get better, people are going to give up if they go from upstairs. Yeah. Are you just going to let them? You told Carly to give her the gun. Yeah, I did. Maybe you were right. I don't know how to handle something like that. Yeah. Anyway, see you around. See ya. I'm beating the shit out of that old guy right now. Oh, it makes you go. Come on, let me go beat the crap out of that old guy. Hey, kid. Close call back there. Thanks for picking me up. No problem. Yeah. We have to take care of each other. Yeah, we do. Mm-hmm. I think you know what you're doing. Shit, man, do any of us? With Clementine, I mean. Earlier, you said you were clueless. I just want you to know that I look at you and I see the type of guy who figures things out. That girl's gonna be just fine. Nah, I know she is. You got it. Da -na -na. Time to go beat the crap out of that old guy. How you doing, Carly? I'm okay. You know, considering. Yeah. yeah. I can't stop thinking about Doug. We couldn't have saved him, could we? I don't think so. It happened pretty fast. I know it's stupid. We just met. And he was such a... It's just that... I think that I liked him. Well, I'm sure he liked you, too. <laughs> you better have. <laughs> anyway, what I'd the? rather be alone, I think. I understand. Wait, Lee? What is it? How did you choose? We both needed you. 
you picked me. I was going to help you both. But you helped me first. Yeah, I did. I just wish we both could have made it, you know? Me too, Connie. Me too. Let's go see how Clem and Dan's doing. I'm beating the shit out of that guy. Was toast, but you know what? He wasn't. Oh, and then. Hey, Duck. Uh, you want to cool it for a minute? Okay. Sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. There's uh, not a lot of kids here. No, it's not that. It's I got grabbed again. I was there though. I fell, and my walkie-talkie broke. Glenn had the other one. Oh no. I'm sorry. Thanks. I know I need to be tough. Yeah. I'm just sad. I know it doesn't make any sense, but it's how I used to talk to my mom and dad. Now, now they're, they're gone. gone. It's gone. Maybe we can find you another one. I'll just keep this one, I guess. Lee, come here for a second. Hmm. Let me go deal with this. Oh, Time man. to beat the hell out of somebody. Another thing. What do you want? Like my daughter? She's fine. She's fine. Fine, huh? Well, just fuck you, Lee Everett. That's right. I know who you are, and I know you're a killer. And you go near my daughter or step on a line once, and so will everyone else. I know who you are. Uh, he's and I don't give a shit about what happens to you. But if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you, <laughs> you watch your ass. Hey, Lee, do you have a second? My dad would be dead if it weren't for you. Yeah, he would be. Yeah, Doug is dead because of me. You can't be like that. You're only one man. We're lucky to have you. I hope that's the sound of us winning this thing. Me too. This motor in's pretty damn defendable. We block off the entrances with some cars, keep someone on watch. We could stay here until the military rolls through. I actually agree with that plan. Me too. We got beds, we got water, and oh, most man. importantly, we got light. There are worse places to call home. Yeah, you're right. All right, guys, that's looking like episode one. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed that. I know it was really long. We'll see if I post the whole thing at once or split it up. But you know that by now what I did. So, anyways, guys, thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you guys next episode.